Welcome to this how-to video. Today we're going to be talking about how to replant with your Gen 1 or Gen 2 2020 SeedSense monitor. First off, if you're using FieldView, let's disable swath streaming so that the system doesn't swath off from cloud coverage when you're trying to plant the field. To do that, let's go to Setup. Then we're going to press on the Systems tab. Under Systems, we're going to go to your Display Setup. Under your display setup, we're going to go down to the bottom where it says streaming coverage, and we want to make sure that says disabled. Press on it if it says enabled, and then it'll toggle to disabled. Next, let's go home. The next step is deleting the field coverage for this field. Go to setup, then click on the field box. Under the field box, select your active field. The active field is the one colored in yellow. Under your active field, we're going to press delete coverage map. Bear in mind that this, that this does not delete your agronomic data. This just deletes the coverage data which is used to swath off. Press yes, and it will delete the swath map. Now we can plant and have active swath control. Next, press home. And the next step is we're going to go ahead and create a custom hybrid in our crop so we can track how many acres we're replanting. Press the setup button and click on the soybean varieties or corn hybrids box. In this case, we planted the field with a DK325 hybrid. We're going to add a custom hybrid named DK325-Replant. Go to another hybrid box that uh, doesn't have a hybrid in it, and we're going to click on Add Hybrid. In this case, we're going to add a DK325-Replant. For your case, take whatever the hybrid name is and add Replant after it. dash, in space, and replant. Doing that, we'll then add a box on the right which says add as custom. We're going to add this as a custom hybrid. Once we've created the hybrid, press enter, and then we're going to assign that hybrid to our rows. In this case, we're planting with all rows on this hybrid. Now the system will track the number of acres that you planted for this replant, and we're good to go. If you have further questions, please feel free to reach out to a precision planning dealer or precision planning product support. Thank you.